Mobile underbase. I'm going to be there in five minutes. Scott and his daughter, Lily, are bringing a barn cat in. Interesting, warm. A little kitten that is in very tough shape. I'd be sad if the baby kitten couldn't make it. I love this kitten a lot. Where's the kitten? On the counter. Oh. Lily found it in the barn, and it was cold. I don't know if the mother abandoned it or what, but it's very, very small yet. She said it was up running around last night. It's important to me and my daughter, and if I can do anything to help it, Dr. Pohl's the one to go see. It's so low, it doesn't even register. She tried giving him some water and stuff. Now, then. What you need is the kitten formula. Kittens this young should be nursing every few hours. Mix it up and start feeding her with a syringe. You gonna feed it? Yeah, she's, she's, yes. good. she's good at it. I think that is a, a very good teaching lesson for a little kid like this to help it. Kitten formula. That's the formula that you make yourself. It's a homemade. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Did you better than I am? I need my glasses. <laughs> and they just start feeding it a little bit at a time. Swallow it. Yep, it's still swallowing. OK. At the same time, we worm it, just to make sure that she doesn't have any. And what I want to do, you take an IV bag, and you throw this in the microwave, make it nice and warm, and put her on there. OK. What we have to do is keep this kitten warm, and an old IV bag really works good for that. Like that, just like that, over the top, and that's how you carry this. And otherwise, it's a lot of TLC. OK? Mm -hmm. You got it? Mm -hmm. Go get busy. If the kitten starts drinking the formula, it'll snap right out of it. If it doesn't, we're going to have a lot of trouble later on. <laughs>